Yeah, now here's an interesting plant. This is the first time I've ever tried this. I like lentils, but I've never grown lentils. I didn't even know what they would look like. So just from a lentil package that I had from the kitchen, I took a few of the lentil beans or lentil seeds, whatever you want to call them, and I put them in one of the pots. And this is what came out of it. I, uh, I see a lot of little flowers here. I don't see any lentils yet. I know they're really small. And uh, I can only imagine what kind of a job it's going to be to, to harvest those tiny little beans, which leads me to wonder about how they're harvested in crops. You know, they must have some kind of a machine or some kind of a way of cutting them and shaking out the beans or something. But anyway, um, lentils, it's an experiment for me. We shall see what happens. Don't imagine I'm going to get a whole lot out of this plant, but you know, I like trying different things and this is brand new to me. So don't be afraid to experiment. And color is also a really nice thing to add to your garden. My wife loves these sweet peas that I put out in the garden and they're, they're not edible, but they sure add a nice color and a nice look to the yard here. These are all coming out of my pots that I've got in the garden. And, you know, geraniums are always nice. So uh, add a little bit of color to your garden as well as a lot of the food that you're fixing and you're gonna end up with something really nice. Now here's my lettuce bed. This is all baby lettuce. And once again, it's way over planted. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pull out some sections of this and break each of these individual heads up and replant them in rows so that I can get larger heads. But even at this stage, their baby lettuce is some of the best lettuce there is.